So I am Krista Smothers and I teach physics and engineering, computer programming and robotics. Over the course of the past few years, the way that I teach my class has changed a lot. So I'm no longer standing in front of the classroom lecturing. A lot of it is problem-based learning, letting the students find something that's interesting and follow their own path. And trying to be more than just the, the teacher, but to be an activator, helping them learn how to learn. We've got some students who have been investigating uh, prosthetic hands for children through a nonprofit named called Enable. Maybe we have a child who's missing part of a finger or something like that, so we could manipulate maybe this image a little bit to then create a prosthetic that would work for that. So we've had examples where they've built things for themselves, but trying to think of ways to create more collaboration. And so for instance, today, we're gonna have the students working on uh, collaboration for a challenge where they have to come up with a food item for something that could be 3D printed in space. We are using the Microsoft 3D Builder application to do the NASA Food Storage Challenge for Future Engineers. Um, this is a challenge where we are to design um, um, containers that would, that would help uh, astronauts eat in space without gravity. Group mates and I continue to work on our idea and we're like, okay, what else do we need for food when you're sitting down to have a meal? And we're like, all right, we need some kind of like drink container. So we came up with cup on a leash. Try and put one in front, one inside the other. Yeah. Okay. So tall yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha. Okay, so we're just going to maybe shrink this down a little bit right here. <laughs> Space. Cup on a leash. Oh, it's cup on a leash, excuse me. We can basically prototype um, our designs which is a lot, what um, innovation is a lot about, just um, testing and retesting until we get a final product that suits what we're trying, the problems we're trying to solve.